Hey guys, today we're gonna be reacting to Ruby Ice Queendom episode seven. Wow, can't believe we're already halfway done with this show. It's been a fun ride so far. As somebody who's new to the Ruby franchise, this has been a great intro to it for me. I know it's not like the traditional way, but I've surely been enjoying this show. I can't wait to see where they go with it. This episode, I am expecting them to wrap up the Nightmare Grim inside of Weiss arc, so to speak. Dude, I this has been a fun arc so far, honestly. Like, no matter what you say, like, it's been beautiful. It's been a cool dive into the way that Weiss sees the world. And I really, really appreciate that kind of character development that we've been getting. And this episode, I'm expecting, like, all the teams to go in. You know, I think they're going to go maybe find uh, Team Juniper again within the silly cage in Weiss's um, city. And then uh, they're going to probably release them. And well, I think John was in there, so maybe John will when he because he replace you replace the person that you are in her dream, so he might actually show up in the silly cage and maybe bust them out. And I think maybe the key, as somebody in the comments section last video uh, said, is going to be actually having uh, Pira appear in front of Weiss in the dream. That might be somebody who she, you know, that's somebody that she looks up to, somebody that she, that inspires her. So it's going to be an interesting thing to see what happens here. I think Ruby obviously is going to be important in, you know, turning Weiss back into a normal person I, because, you know, Ruby clearly, um, or Weiss clearly it does value Ruby and Ruby has is the kind of the emotional linchpin of the team um but also blake too is going to be really important they all have these interesting connections amongst each other and the way that weiss views them but you know they've started to realize that the reasons behind weiss's uh, actions and the way that she acts towards them and that she really is a good person deep down and that she really does appreciate them as part of her team although she doesn't show it very well because she's a little tsundere but you know we all can appreciate a good tsundere we're we're all anime fans here so you know i'm really excited to see where it goes from here i have no idea where it's going to go after they conclude this arc but that's totally fine i'm totally happy to see what that, whatever shaft wants to give us with this ruby series finishing it out um but guys if you enjoy ruby content and you want to see it on the channel please do leave the video a like it really really helps me out and also subscribe if you're new to the channel we're really really close to 1000 subs we're so so close and we were trying to get it by the end of august 2022 so please do that if you're new to the channel i really appreciate you guys i love talking to you guys in the comments so keep them coming and i'll keep replying let's get into today's episode of ruby to the dream again okay so they're starting over from part one Gotta get my coffee in here, man. It's I'm falling asleep. Okay, maybe he wasn't inside the cage. That got proven wrong immediately. <laughs> oh, so that's the way she sees him. <laughs> I mean, that's true. He can't handle his own aura. So that makes sense. Only three this time. They had four last time. I guess there's more of them. <laughs> John, you're a little me, aren't you, boy? And they're back to the sign. Does he actually have an idea? Lida. Looks like a sniper. <laughs> Probably should just pitch that. He's got. Oh, she's gonna use like a sniper now. Like an. I, are they gonna? Is they gonna attack those guys? Oh, we, we always get this train scene, but like nothing happens because of it. Or I wonder if their plan is to get them to have the train actually arrive this time for some reason. This is the first time they've actually interacted with it. So they're taking down the White Fang. Or what uh, Weiss sees as the White Fang. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> uh, John, poor John. It worked! <laughs> oh, I'm sure you don't need it. <laughs> That's true. It's too loud. So this is going to be different. Oh, it's going to take them directly into the city. And now this is unwinding. Oh, the sign was unwinding. That's a, that's that's got to be a, a sign. 
that maybe like she's getting broken or like she's the the uh, nightmare grim is unwinding its grip on her so to speak okay see it's yeah see that's like the one thing that she never would have expected to happen oh this is gonna take them directly to the heart of the city Well, I mean, that's just the door. This guy is so strange. Hi. Open it. Oh, there he is! Whoa. They're just gonna crash into it if they don't open it. Open up your heart. Open up your heart! It's a metaphor. Come on. Come on. Yes. Do it. Ooh. This track. Ice Queen. It's a metaphor for letting them into her heart. Let's go! Yay! Look at this shit! Holy crap! There's so many layers to this. You can see the the Grimm's vines still having a hold, but clearly loosening its grip, as we saw with the sign. Dream maintenance. <laughs> Here it comes. Whoa, it's in the the track goes through all of the buildings. <laughs> the thing is going fast. Big Nicholas. Oh my god, this background music is amazing. Yeah, where does this lead? Oh no, it goes oh the, whoa. Going straight to the center. Oh my god, this is cool! Look at this! Look at this shit! Yeah. This is awesome! And this music is just... Woo! Amazing! Whoa, what is this? Something new appeared. Yeah, what is this? Oh, it is like a train station. But like, it looks like a carnival. So this was... Oh, yeah, that, I mean, this is technically um, Yang's part of her plan. We still have... I wonder if all three of their plans are going to be simultaneously used. Or used in stepwise fashion, then. Biga Nikolusa! Oh, because he lost his cape? <laughs> but what's on the train? Besides them. You have a responsibility. What is your responsibility? Here we go. We're starting to break through. Yo, shut up. Nuisance. What is the significance of that shadow laughing? Yeah, so she's that's still being her part of her Shni family responsibility there when she says that, but so she's still targeting Blake here. Still got some time left here. Pira, of course, supporting him. So what's his goal here? I totally forgot. <laughs> Oh, the Grim. Is it not gonna see him because he's? Yeah, it didn't notice him because of his association with the Grim before. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> 
So where is he going though? Hello, the sillies. <laughs> You're not supposed to go outside, dummy. <laughs> There's, there they are. Let him out. <laughs> Gotta keep the sillies locked up. <laughs> what? Oh, is are we gonna get another pure? What? What, what just happened? <laughs> All of a sudden, it's a freaking fair. Oh, they're still talking like that. Oh, oh, that's cute. Don't get distracted, John. Oh. Stop. Oh, it's the yellow rook. The relic. They need that. Oh. Yeah, it's different than the other one. Go. What? What? Look at all the little Weisses! Oh, they're cause- I'm gonna be honest, this is adorable. <laughs> oh, there comes all the little Weisses! Oh, is this- is this Weiss's true desire? She wants to go out outside and, you know, play and be a normal little girl? Like, isn't- isn't that what this is? She kept her childhood feelings locked up? Oh. So I was kind of right. Dummies? She's so adorable when she was a little girl. I want to be free! Oh! Oh, this is so cute! I love this. This is all of her desires. John was the key. I don't want to mind my banners. That's cool. That's a really cool way to show that. Oh, they're talking now. Yeah. But Pierre hasn't said anything yet. Oh, look, his sword actually is usable now. You carry a super heavy responsibility. Because she has these desires? Yeah. Get out of here, little brother. Everything is breaking down. The walls inside her heart are breaking down. Unforgivable use. Time for another checkpoint. Yes. This is the time. Woo! I wonder what. Oh, because he was sick whenever he had. Oh, that's cute. This is so weird seeing the robots do that. Look at the chaos. Whoa! Whoa! What's with that? What is it? Whoa, this is weird. Piras hasn't spoken yet. What is happening? They all got big! They're a bunch of giant little... Giant little girls. Weiss, running around. Okay. Getting a little bit conceited now. What happened to them? Oh, they got the Grim took over them. The Grim tightened its control on them. That's why they look so creepy. What? Is this Weiss? Oh, 
Yep. Whoa! What is she doing? Thunderstorm? Whoa! What is this? What is... What is that? Whoa! Is it making a giant robot statue out of this statue? That thing is a giant mecha. Are you kidding? Dun, 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 dun. Whoa! Yeah, me too. Me too, John. What is that? That's scary as hell. The name of Big Nicholas will receive judgment. Oh, man. And that's where it ends. I thought we were going to finish this episode, but no, it's not going to be that simple. Wow, so I guess we're going to keep going with this arc. I thought for sure that this was going to be the conclusion to this arc, but no, it still has a grip on Weiss. The Nightmare Grim is not given up quite yet. And, it, you know, it's still, I think it's going to lead up to a really brilliant, brilliant conclusion. You know, all of this, the time that they're putting into this development is just so good, dude. This is so interesting to watch. John being the key here, finding the yellow relic this time. You know, we had the red relic last time. We had the white relic, which was in Weiss's office or her room um, within the um, castle in this little dream world that we have here. Um, so I was somewhat right that they're about them being other relics. But there must be a black relic somewhere too. Um, but wow, giant mecha fight incoming next episode. And shaft handling the animation, of course. I just can't wait to see that. I am super, super hyped about Ruby right now, guys. If you guys enjoy the content on the channel and you want to see more Ruby and eventually maybe the OG Ruby on the channel, please don't forget to leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you're new. And I can't finish this video without thanking my one god tier subscriber on Patreon, Miss Construe. Thank you so much for supporting me and all of the work that I put in for you guys. And if you and if you guys want to see my unedited, uncut reactions or they even hit YouTube, make sure to go to my Patreon link in the description below if you guys are interested in that. Like honestly, guys, if you liking and subscribing and commenting is all I could really ask of you guys. You guys are doing amazing, and I love I love each and every one of you guys. But that's enough for me for today guys i've been zach you've been you and i will see you guys all in the next one